Hi everyone, um, so I got up this morning and my package come from Steph's Piggy Paradise. Um, I saw it on Facebook and um, I wanted a few beds for Bambi and I really shopped about because I wanted the best deal and unfortunately there's a few out there that um, charge really high prices especially even if they cover the material and the postage it's still really high and um i just i don't i like supporting uk companies and especially small companies but i don't like being not ripped off but um maybe you know they could definitely drop the prices and still make a profit so anyway um i tried a few and um where are you going Hello, where are you going? What are you doing? Hello. She woke up in a really good mood today, haven't you, Bambi? She has. She's woke up in a good mood. So, anyway. Now, um, Steph's Piggy Paradise. And they're all handmade items for your pampered pet. So that's definitely Bambi. So it just says, thank you for your order. And there's just... It some information on how to wash your items so if anyone's interested it's 30 to 40 degrees uh, and a low temperature and they don't suggest tumble drying and at the bottom it just says thank you for your order and I hope you are liking your items so that was really nice and um, it come in this lovely pink package oi cheeky do you want to have a look what we got yeah do you want to see so the first item I got, and um, when I saw the pattern I really liked it, was this um, vintage like rose type pattern, if you can see. And it's really pretty. And um, this is actually the small pig size, but when I asked for the measurements of the rabbit one compared to the pig one um for bambi because she's so small like some people have guinea pig bars that are actually much bigger than her so when i looked at the size i thought this one sounded perfect because if she sprawls out across it it'll kind of accommodate her bambi come here what's this what's that i think it's supposed to sit in the middle or missus there we go what's this it's your new bed. I think she likes it. She's digging it. <laughs> Oi, don't be chewing. She's not a massive chewer, like she has fleas and she never really chews it, but I think she's just investigating it. <laughs> You're digging it. You're digging it. So she really likes that. Um totally forgot how much these were. Five pound each. Um, I think, no, £7? Anyway, it was really cheap. I want to say 5 Anyway, so they're really well made. This is actually part of it, so it won't come out. And it feels like it's got like an absorbent thing in the bottom. I'm not too sure. But it's not really an issue for Bambi because she doesn't really pee. So yeah, um, I really like this and... On the other online shops, um, if you get a piggy sized cuddle cup or whatever they want to call them, it's basically like a dog basket bed, isn't it? Um, but if you get one on online elsewhere, I actually looked at some people's reviews and things and they, a lot of them shrunk from other places or if they, got, they bought it hoping to fit the pair of pigs in because obviously pigs come in pairs. You know, you shouldn't really have a lawn pig, but anyway, and um, they'd get them elsewhere and it wouldn't actually fit two pigs in. So I heard that like other shops have been really small and things. So yeah, I'm really happy with that size. And if you have two pigs, they would definitely fit in that. Um, even, I dare say two bars could squish in. Do you like your bed? So yeah. So then I got another bed because I wanted... Um, the option to switch them out um, if I wash them. So the other one I ordered is cupcakes because Bambi has cupcake fleece and she has cupcake wood chew so I thought it would go really, really nice. 
So there we go, and um, I did want a lighter light blue lining for this one, but I think that um, sold out, but I'm really glad I got the dark pink because it'll just look cleaner and keep for longer, won't it? So yeah, I'm really happy with them, they're really pretty, and um, it's just what I wanted, and they're just the right size. Bambi, Bambi, come here, come test your, come test your beds out, come here. Look, what's this? So obviously you can see compared to Bambi's size, it's sort of the ideal size. You scratching. I don't think she's in the mood to snuggle. Monkey. So then while I placed this order, why I was pissed pasting? <laughs> while I was paying for postage, I thought I may as well um get everything I wanted and I've actually seen these in other people's videos and because I do plan on getting a guinea pig at some point um, I thought it'd be nice to order it now as they were quite cheap compared to elsewhere so the last thing I got was a waterproof lap pad Oi! don't chew missus it's not really the right time to give her it if she's in this chewing mood come and sit here be nice. So the last thing I got was this waterproof lap pad and um, I actually seen that um, Steph done some patchwork ones and I asked for patchwork in pink and purple and I wasn't too fussed in what patterns and things but um, I really like how this clamp. I like the dark purple because I'm a fan of purple and um, I just thought I'd break the pink up in the cage. I think she really likes that bed. Do you like that? Do you like your bed? You look like a princess. You look like a princess. You can hear her chewing it. Oi, stop chewing. It's because she's full of beans and she was in the run, so she's not in the right mood really for fleece. Anyway, so in this, this was £5. I know this was definitely £5, this waterproof flat pad. And inside it has... I don't know if you can hear, but it's like a thick. Oi! What you've done? I was going to keep that information, missus. So I just thought this would be ideal underneath water bottle as well. Um, obviously, Bambi doesn't pee on me, so it wouldn't necessarily be used as a lap pad for t um, Bambi. But yeah, I'm really happy, and it's got these. Nice pink and blue stars and pink and purple stars. There's a bit of a cupcake here, and that's a different pattern cupcake, I think. And there's just some pink and some white there. And that's the other side. So I'm really happy with them. Um, they're from Steph's Piggy Paradise. And she is on Facebook. If you just type in Steph's Piggy Paradise, you can find her. And um, I thought it was good value for money. Postage was like £5. Postage was nearly £6, but when I looked at the packet, it cost more than that to send, so obviously people have got to cover the postage, um, and I think that the quality, I mean, Bambi's given it a good chew and nothing's coming off, <laughs> it's just pretty good. But yeah, so I'll just show you the patterns again. If I turn them that way, you get a good idea of the patterns. So they're really cute. Um, I think the next time I order things like this, because... Obviously things like this, you kind of order more and replace them. I'd probably get the um, pattern inside and the pink on the outside. I think if I reversed it, that might be nice. But no, I'm really happy with them. Do you like them? Do you like them? I'm just going to... Okay. Okay, it's just going to chew everything. So... Yeah, thanks for watching and uh, I'll leave the link below for Steph's Piggy Paradise if you want to go check them out and oh, if you heard that shouting outside. Anyway, so I'm going to go. Oi, chewing. Misses. But Bambi will just be giving the beds on an evening right before she goes to bed because if I give her during the day she's going to do stuff like this, dig it and try to play with it and chew it. But yeah, so... Hope you like um, this haul and um, thank you very much for watching. Bye.